Once upon a time, I climbed the high mountain, and then I met a man, an old man with a long beard. And I asked him, "What is the meaning of life?" Well, that's bullshit, because through countless efforts in my life of being crushed down to zero and rising up and being crushed down to zero and so on several times and standing up to make a stance heroically, I wondered what is the purpose of life, what is the meaning of all this crap. And uh, years ago I decided that I make my own purpose and the strength in coining this purpose heroically, living like a true man, true woman, is the purpose and meaning of life. There are two concepts in the Hindi philosophical system. One is Lila, the play of the gods, an initiation, regeneration, destruction. And Lila means also a play. So you play along in the universe of powers and forces in a wise, insightful manner, discovering truth tearing down the illusions, the maya, the illusion, the veils of deception and delusion. And even if you find a person, like a Buddha, someplace out there, who peers through the veils and found enlightenment, nirvana, parinirvana, or even parisunyata, if he stays in the game, for example, as a Bodhisattva, he plays the game and he coins the purposes on you, the meanings of life are coined in you. And it's quite nihilistic to say that there is no meaning to life, because you create them. This is the fetist. Maybe in the cosmic machinery, Deus Ex Machina, life is purposeless. And Mother Nature is a bitch. It orders you to carry on with the life. Or unless you do something to yourself or you die in some place. Anyways, even when you are deeply troubled and destroyed and ruined, and you decide to rise and stand up and coin the meaning of your life, coin a purpose in your life, then it becomes meaningful and purposeful. It is self-driven, like a perpetuum mobile. So the wise men of the Monkey Mountain ponder deeply. And as I climbed that mountain, I threw him down the cliff. He crushed his skull and died. Not that I took his place, I just went further down the valley and discovered some fucking awesome shit at the very end of it there was a little hut with some fruit a banana which I ate and I went further on thinking about how I killed the wise man thank you